someone is coming out as a wounded warrior when it comes to your energy. Someone knows that you have the strength to deal or heal a situation, but because of their choices, they feel like you're guarded or moving differently because of their intentions. I feel this is someone who abused the connection or their position by being impulsive or weak. This is someone who was disloyal, made a bad example, or made some bad choices through their scattered energy. I feel like this is someone who felt entitled within a situation. This is what caused them to be scattered. The King of Pentacles energy, well, the King of Wands is coming out in the reverse, where someone has made some choices that they are now fatigued of. I feel this is someone who is wanting to push forward within a situation, but they're over-emotional. There's a lot of imbalance, anxiety, stress. This is someone who is going through a lot of doubt and fear. So it seems someone knows they made the wrong move. They want to ask for help, but something is stagnated. Something is um, a little different than usual. This is someone who has di disappointed you in the past, but something is different. As this is someone who has made some bold choices that has caused them to be put in a position of a crossroads. Hmm. I feel this is someone who's come to a crossroads when it comes to a decision, a crossroads when it comes to an unhealthy ego, where someone is seeing the truth about their pride, their street mentality, their victim-like ways. I feel this is someone who can be very materialistic or low vibrational, especially when it comes to a soulmate, a close bond. I feel this is someone who is wounded yet longing for you, but there is an imbalance. Something is out of alignment as someone could be confused or just stuck in a matrix of bad decisions that got them no reward as this is someone who is now feeling blocked for not listening, not giving in, not compromising, not seeing the truth, holding something back when it comes to other issues, bad habits. Someone is very stubborn when it comes to reaching out, being excessive, impulsive, or even having multiple issues or multiple partners. I feel this is someone who didn't make the right choices and now they're blocked because of their lack of structure, choosing money over love, or if this is someone who did something in a very superficial way. I feel this is someone who thought that they were going to gain, but they ended up being distorted and weak due to the choices they have made. I feel this is someone who has made some choices thinking it was going to bring some type of abundance, attraction. Now someone is wanting you to sympathize with them with the energy of Venus. This can also be Libra energy. Please take it how it resonates. But I definitely feel someone is at a crossroads. I also see Cancer energy here. Please take it how it resonates. But someone is sitting in a space where their insecurities have brought them to a crossroads where they're going through a karmic storm. And I feel someone is going through a karmic debt where they're paying the piper, mm. reaping what they have sown. Someone is truly stressed out by the choices they have made. But something is definitely coming to a harsh ending where someone is going through a rebirth or a realization when it comes to life and especially when it comes to you. This is someone who is wounded by the separation, but they're not wanting to talk about it. This is someone who is not wanting to admit their defeat, so they're still making choices to stay in competition, even though they're burnt out, stressed, heavily stressed. Mm. Rigid energy, Aquarius as well, sudden energy of someone going through sudden change. Something is very unpredictable when it comes to their energy. There's a lot of change, t tension. Someone failed to be authentic, and now someone is thinking about how something was exposed to them or how something is now being exposed about them. Someone knows they either dealt you a bad hand or they're now receiving one in return. I feel this is someone who has a dark side to a very unhealthy ego because of confusion, illusion, someone being deceptive out of intention, someone's being impulsive and careless with you. I feel this is someone who took a risk and became unreliable, unfocused, and disorganized. I feel this is someone who had a low self-esteem and was weak to temptation. Hmm. 
pretending to have a bad memory. Someone got caught up in something that caused them to look unloyal, unfaithful, full of games, secrets, and lies. I feel this is someone who is com coming out as distorted energy because they have no structure. This is someone who is brutal, ruthless. Someone who comes out as cold or a dictator is now going through some harsh things when it comes to labels, truth, anxiety, fears. Something definitely runs deep when it comes to you. Someone is now going through cause and effect and when it rains, it definitely pours as this wounded warrior is now thinking about you and how they lost you. Let's get some more energy here. We also have Scorpio energy here. It's coming out in the reverse. Someone's jealous, insecure. They're carrying a sense of guilt, but they're still trying to control something through their stubborn ways as their distrust for others has caused them to be a little reckless. Still holding on to things that don't really matter because someone is still moving out of impulse, attached to something they need to let go. But someone is holding on to a, a false environment or a third party because they are afraid of being alone or rejected right now. So they're just kind of taking what they can get. I feel this is someone who is having bad memory or confusion just to forget about what they refuse to heal. As this is someone who is still sitting in a space of confusion, Pisces energy here, Cancer energy as well, please take it how it resonates, but someone is in denial and it's only causing more stress for them. We also have Gemini energy here as well as the Virgo energy, please take it how it resonates, Scorpio energy. Hmm. Wow, lack of growth, instability, there's a scarce, Someone's broken, struggling. Ace of Pentacles is coming out in the reverse. I usually don't pull from this side of the deck. Hmm. That's kind of uh, interesting to me. Someone's going through a sense of shame because of their lack of growth. Now they're going through instability due to their poor choices, greed. Someone's going through a lack of opportunity. I feel this is someone who is going through a lot. We also have Leo energy here. Someone sitting in arrogant energy that only caused them to be more naive. Someone's trying to dominate something with you and they didn't see something coming. They were naive to a situation. And this is why I feel you're dealing with someone who is going through an ego death. A dark side to an unhealthy ego has caused someone to go through a change that they didn't see coming, a transformation. A transformation where someone is going to realize something or discover something when it comes to their core. Mm. Mm. So I feel like someone is going through a, a death and rebirth, especially when it comes to things that they refuse to see. I feel this is someone who's been very impulsive giving in to weaknesses, causing a lot of changes that didn't give a lot of growth. I feel this is someone who is struggling right now and going through a karmic storm where someone is going through a lot of bad karma for their vices. Someone is broke, struggling, and going through a lot of delays due to a toxic or obsessive connection. This could also be a karmic partner. And for others, this could also be a false environment, a false family, or a connection that they thought was going to be abundant for them. But for many of you, someone is going through a storm when it comes to a karmic partner or uh, a tribe, an energy where there is like-minded ways that get them nowhere because this energy is having bad fortune. I feel this is someone who has a heavy energy of problems and stress attached to them. Sagittarius, Pisces, please take it how it resonates. But I feel this is someone who is emotionally immature, ungrounded. There's a lot of noise in the background. This energy can't think. This energy is heavily stressed and they're missing opportunities because of their poor choices. I feel this is someone who's going through a reality check for juggling people, places, and things. I feel this is someone who's going through a reality check when it comes to taking love seriously. I feel this is someone who's going through a lot of sudden choices or sudden changes here. This could be someone moving. 
there's bad fortune where problems are running heavy when it comes to stability, third party energies, who they should trust, who they should reach out to, someone that's going through poverty, rock bottom energy. This is homeless energy where someone's poor decisions has caused them to bounce around, not have a stable situation. Someone could also be in a space of a mental prison. This is self-imposed restrictions for someone who is trying to come up with a plan. Hmm. Someone's trying to come up with a plan because they hit rock bottom for being a fraud, an amateur, hmm. a con artist for some of you. This is someone who has blocked chakras and they need more practice when it comes to being authentic. <laughs> and this is why they may have run into you. I feel for many of you, this is someone who underestimated you because of your willingness to help but i feel a sudden change caused them to lose their right or access to you because they had no heart having no heart having a lack of understanding caused them to juggle something with you making poor choices caused them to miss an opportunity they may never receive again i feel this is someone who is lacking in direction Capricorn and Aquarius energy sitting in Sagittarius. I feel someone is going through a lack of structure and discipline as well as a sense of wisdom that's only bringing them more karma. There's a lot of stress attached to them. Someone is going through a lot of pain emotionally, financially, stability wise. Someone doesn't know who to count on. I feel this is someone who is stressing something out or has overstayed their welcome in a situation whether that is in a friendship or a relationship, a toxic situation or environment, someone has definitely been worn thin. Someone is wanting to cut the cord because they feel like they've been drained in a false environment. But I feel also you standing still or standing your ground, walking away, cause someone to slow down and think about something in a very serious way as this is someone who is out of alignment and this is why they're taking no action even though they're wanting to talk this is someone who feels restricted they're sitting in a space of fear not wanting to be rejected because they have a guilty conscience someone knows what they did to you and they know they took something too far they were out of line but the fact that they have wasted so much time has caused them to hesitate hmm. Someone is wanting to talk, but they feel restricted. I feel they're getting every sign to reach out. They're getting the signs and symbols t to give you some type of message or answer, listen. Mm. But something is silent because something is background. Return to sender energy for some of you, but someone is blocked. Someone is blocked because they feel exposed. Whether that is because they're vulnerable to another situation or this energy feels exposed to you finally seeing the truth about them. I feel the ancestors have definitely intervened. This is why something has slowed down. The floodgates are closed and someone is wanting to communicate with you. This could be an unexpected message or text, a phone call, voicemail. This is a pop-up energy for some of you where someone is wanting to unexpectedly do something here. There could be planning. Someone is wanting to make a U-turn. Someone is wanting to make this U-turn to communicate with you. But due to the fact that things are backfiring or things are just not going their way, I feel it's the universe intervening. Mm. So, uh, okay, the Libra card is coming out again. So someone thought that something was going to work out, but the fact that something has slowed down and something is not as abundant as they thought that it would be, something is starting to scare them now that the connection with you is no longer the same. This is someone who's thinking things have never been like this. This is someone who always thought that they would have access to you. But I feel before they could ever make this U-turn or come back your way, they're going to have to go through this tower moment. This tower moment is destruction, revelation trauma, disaster. This is great loss for someone who's about to go through an upheaval. An upheaval of shock, pain, chaos, and natural disasters of their life. As I feel someone is going through a dark side of an unhealthy ego because of their secrets, hiding their emotions, 
destroying their own dreams. Cancer energy here. Hmm. I feel someone lost their way by being distorted, keeping secrets. Hmm. Now there could be deep-rooted fears. For some of you, there is also an illness here. Someone could be ill and not wanting to talk about it. Hmm. There's a lot of conflict here. There's a lot of lies and trust issues that is only causing more disharmony. I feel this is someone who needs to tell you something. But I feel whatever this confession is that they need to communicate to you about, it's, it's big. Whatever this communication is, it's, it's really big. And someone doesn't want things to end like this. This is someone who doesn't want things to end in this way, yet they have still yet to make some decisions that moves them towards you because they're going through a lot of delays and distractions due to their poor sense of communications, their greed, their lack of growth, as well as the fact that they're kind of struggling right now through their karma, their lack of opportunities. This is someone who is just not having their way. Hitting rock bottom was not what they expected. But I sense the fact that they took their blessings for granted is how they ended up. Hmm. How did, how they ended up in this energy of having bad misfortune or bad energy surrounding them. This is someone who's stressed out and having a lot of problems. Let's get some more energy here. I feel like this is is someone who is learning a valuable lesson of love and intention when it comes to you as well as their choices because I feel like their mistakes and their habits have put them in some very uncomfortable situations that cause them to regret leaving or mistreating you someone knows that the damage they caused was unnecessary because now that they feel their actions have changed the way that you view them, they feel you turn your back for good. This is someone who didn't value your energy and time when they had it. Now they're just wanting to put the past behind them. Now they now that they've come to some type of realization that you may be better off or happier by yourself. I feel like someone has reached out to someone who knows you or somehow, some way, someone has found out that you have found a way, even though something has no closure. You could be vibing solo, relaxing, trying to figure something out. Someone feels like you're not bothered. This is someone who is completely drained and they thought the way you feel about them would never change. But the fact that they doubted you or didn't understand their position, someone lost out and they lost out big because now their selfish ways have brought them to a space of greed, poverty, and struggle. I feel communication isn't the same or relationships and bonds are not the same because someone is going through bad fortune. Someone is feeling foolish and wanting to return. Someone is wanting to return to what you used to have together. Someone is wanting to return to a commitment. Someone is wanting you to know that they have good intentions. Someone wants you to feel like you can be in a safe position with them. But I feel something is going nowhere. Hmm. Something is going nowhere because someone is just cutting corners. Still going through a dark night of the soul. Someone is trying to cut the corners to lighten their load. Someone feels lightening their load is just coming back to you whether healed or not healed. But I feel someone has yet to really feel hmm, the pain of what they've done. This is why access is denied. Whether you want them around or not, someone needs to learn. And it's unfortunate that they're going to have to learn the hard way. I feel someone, someone is hitting a dead end or a bad sense of self. I feel someone has hit a dead end and feeling foolish for a decision. I feel this is someone who made a decision to guard their heart, which only caused many of you to dodge a bullet. Because this is someone who became unavailable, but I feel restricting their heart to you. 
only cause them to go crazy in the end because you accepted something that they didn't accept they didn't expect you to accept <sighs> I feel many of you accepted the fact that this energy was never going to change for many of you this is someone who was trying to drive you crazy with their choices but this is someone whose choices only drove them insane I feel this is someone who rocked the boat never solved any problems because they are a poor communicator and they're always coping through toxic ways, never being reliable. This is someone who was guarded, never giving a confession or speaking up because they were trying to put on a show or this energy was trying to pretend like they had some type of club exterior. But now this is someone who feels like a fool. Someone is bored with their choices and they're a little worried because they feel like you're vibing solo. They missed the opportunity to make something right. I feel there was a conversation where this energy was still doubting you, hoping that you fell for something. But something backfired. Now the chemistry is off. Because they failed to make a positive change. I feel this is someone who wants to communicate but they feel like the last time they reached out, Things went left. They regret everything. This is someone who regrets not truly making an effort or seeing your pain. Projecting instead of reflecting the same energy that was given. Many of you are just tired of the rain and the pain. I feel like this is someone who made some very harsh choices when it comes to the situation. And the fact that they made a lot of decisions that gave a lot of mixed signals is the reason why something came to a dead end. I feel this is someone who caused you to have a lot of questions but gave no answers. And this is why something went nowhere. Someone hit a dead end and now they're paying for it through blood, sweat, and tears. Because even though they pretend to be content with their choices, someone is miserable behind the scenes regretting the fact that they forced you to turn your back or react. I feel this is someone who is coming out as stubborn or cheater. They feel like they don't have a fighting chance because of all the drama they caused. Because none of the problems are resolved. I feel none of the problems are resolved because they were wearing a mask or they were masking their emotions causing many of you to dodge a bullet when it comes to someone who is unable to be loyal a cheating heart I feel someone ghosted you or they were unloyal or disruptive they're feeling guilty about it someone's feeling guilty about the love that was wasn't given someone feels guilty about Manipulating a situation, not showing you their hand. This is someone who stabbed you in the back without a reason or was re reckless within a home, broke some promises. And now this is someone who wants more, but doesn't know how to make an offer. This is someone who wants to make an offer, but they're still unavailable emotionally. They're really stressed out. As I said before, even though this energy wants to come towards you, it doesn't mean they have the tools to do so. Someone's still not ready. Knowing they can't beg their way out of this, someone knows they went too far, you went above and beyond when it comes to help and support, but they took the wrong route. Someone's going through a lot of stress, a lot of bad karma because they were unrealistic when it comes to loving you. you know, someone knows you got a lot of love for them and they misuse that energy mm. and now they're going through karma because of it this is destruction and upheavals where someone is learning some real lessons mm. when it comes to having this tough exterior because in the end someone will confess or continue to go through the stress I feel like this is someone who feels like they don't have a fighting chance because of all the drama they caused. Because now that you are unbothered or living in a different way, someone is silent, hoping you can't prove it. Hoping you can't prove 
their deception or their harsh ways of never being there for you or respecting the love you gave. I feel this is someone who is going through a lot, not wanting to admit it. Someone doesn't want you to see the karma that they're going through. In fact, I feel like this is someone who misses you so much. They now feel invisible to you. Things are just not working out for them, yet they're the ones who put something in this position. Mm. Mm. So what I'm receiving here is this is someone who is feeling like they're invisible to you. But I feel this is someone who made the choice to disappear. As they have hurt you in ways you never thought they could or never thought possible. They were convinced they would do fine without you, but I feel this is someone who is now learning the hard way that is not the truth. I feel like this is someone who is learning the hard way that they can't burn their bridges to light their way. As I sense, they never truly gave this a fighting chance. This is someone who never gave you a fighting chance, and this is why they feel they won't get that same energy. Not after what they have done or all the things they have took you through. Because they always thought they would have the opportunity to make something right. They never put in the effort with you. I feel like this is someone who always knew they'd come back or they felt entitled to that energy. But they never thought that things would be so harsh and they would have to show up looking like this. Because whatever it is, they won't be looking good. Because whatever path they chose, they wouldn't be for it. Someone wasn't built for the guilt, the shame, the pain. Someone wasn't built to hide it. Not this long. Oh, let me make it here. Someone knows that the mutual love you gave, you went above and beyond. Someone knows that you went above and beyond to make this a connection that was worth having. But someone took a risk anyways, knowing that it was a heavy risk to take. They took the chance anyways. Someone was playing games. Someone was playing games when it comes to connections and love. This is someone who was off and on like a light switch. Now they're going through things they never thought they'd go through. I feel this is someone who has hit rock bottom wanting to make a romantic gesture when it comes to spending time or making something right. But many of you, they feel like they won't get the same energy they once did. This is someone who believes that you won't believe a word they say. And for some of you, that is actually the truth. All you hear is blah, blah, blah. Someone feels like you're unbothered when it comes to rebuilding. They're confused. This is someone who is confused because they want to make something right, but the fact that they now want you doesn't mean they deserve that right. I feel you were taken through a lot for no apparent reason, all because they are broke or broken. They tried to break you. Now they realize you can't be broken. I feel this is someone who wants to rebuild with you and they're confused when it comes to a breakup or getting caught up. This is someone who's still holding some resentment or salty energy from being naive. They thought that something was going to work out, but it didn't. But I feel the scales are being balanced for someone who didn't show any appreciation. They just broke your heart. I feel this is someone who never showed you any true appreciation. They just disappointed you in various ways. Now someone is shocked because they don't have the access that they once had. Or you could be finding something new to focus on. But I feel someone is also being pushed to a breaking point. They're trained. This energy is completely drained by their lies their karmic debt and their karmic storm and someone is definitely paying a toll for leaving or trying to move on because there's a lot of chaos when it comes to a connection or a home or someone truly wrecks something by being disconnected with you now justice is playing out 
something is becoming fair, something is becoming aligned as their life is blowing up before their eyes. Something is backfiring and it's driving them crazy. Someone is trying to have a tough exterior, trying to get through this storm. Someone is trying to get through the storm, but they're needing to come clean. Someone needs to come clean when it comes to a connection or something that should have went the distance because they are the true reason something fell apart. I feel this is someone who doesn't have access because they're going through a lot right now that they're going to have to get through on their own. I feel this is someone who created the mess and now they're going to have to clean it up with intention. As this is someone who is going through a lot of problems and stress, they've hit rock bottom not knowing who to trust. This is someone who is falling victim to their own stress, their own mess, their own intentions. Someone really doesn't know how to deal with that. Let's get a different deck out here. This is someone who never thought things would fall apart like this. As I said before, someone is going through a lot of stress when it comes to their finances, their connections, their stability. This is someone who never thought that they would feel like this or fall like this. This is someone who always knew that, that they would come crawling back to you, but never like this. Not broken, broken, worse than they left you before. Hmm. But they know they can't escape what they don't see what they refuse to see or what they refuse to believe because this is someone who is definitely in their feelings someone is in their feelings about this connection someone just doesn't want to be a friend or someone you used to know but someone needs to deal with their self-worth or get some therapy when it comes to their weaknesses or boundaries someone is still wearing a mask and in their feelings but something has yet to change as something is still unresolved. I feel this is someone who needs to check themselves. They're going through a storm, but they're not wanting to be confronted about it. I feel this is something that has gone on for so long. Someone has felt some type of entitlement to the destruction that they have caused. This is chaos and upheavals for someone who is losing self through turbulence. Mm. Wow. I feel this is someone who caused destruction when it comes to a commitment where they lack in values. They created cultural differences or a difference in belief or tradition as their non-conforming ways caused them to be unconventional, insecure, and arrogant. I feel this is someone who was very rude and opinionated, but never having any real solutions to a situation. They were just talking out of emotion, insecurity still playing games, never having any boundaries. This is someone who is always hiding behind their true self. Mm. Camouflaging their true ways through repeating patterns. Mm. This is someone who is always repeating patterns, always doing the same thing again and again. They know that they owe you an apology, but this is someone who is yet to give you that because they have lost themselves through attachments and third parties and creating their own misery. This is someone who is unhappy, numbing the pain, and disassociating themselves through bad company. This is someone who has repetitive behaviors where there's no change. Not realizing that actions speak louder than words. Someone failed to give you a true apology. They're just stuck in a false sense of self. Mm. Playing games when it comes to third parties. Chasing thrills. Someone is creating this misery. But this misery will soon turn into a deep sense of regret. Because the storm that comes their way will bring troubles, turbulence, explosive conflict, and tension. Tension where there will be transformation due to the pain. I feel this is someone who lacks a sense of value and tradition through lifestyle. This is someone who's being very rebellious. This is someone who is refusing to go with the flow. I feel this is someone who doesn't know how to give the love that you deserve. But I also feel the fact that they have yet to make any sense of this is the reason they have chosen to avoid you. Believing they're ex escaping the consequences of karma, 
not realizing they're standing in the thick of it because whatever problems or issues that they're running from are now chasing them. I feel this is someone who is going through a storm and as I said before, when it rains it cools. Someone is now realizing wherever they go, there's the rain, there's the storm. Mm. Someone is bringing the storm wherever they go, their issues, their problems. Final energy here. We're gonna shut this room really down. Wow, someone's insecurities, lustful ways, and weaknesses of greed and ego has led them astray. This is someone who is doing a lot behind the scenes and not wanting to admit their issues or their problems, but their weaknesses of instant gratification is definitely an issue. I feel someone is in their feelings and to numb the pain, they do a lot of toxic things that lead them to a space where they're going nowhere. But I feel someone's ego and pride is about to unleash hell on their ass because someone didn't see this karmic retribution coming their way because as I said before someone is going through a karmic storm where they're trying to weather the energy but I feel what it's about to rain down on them is something that they have yet to experience but they should also know not many survive it because this karmic storm that this energy is about to go through is no joke they're in hermit mode, hoping that they could avoid something, but someone's in hermit mode, thinking that their skeletons won't be revealed. Hmm. They're sending mixed signals because they feel something is coming their way. They know something is going to be unpredictable, but they're banking on something. They're banking on time. Hmm. Someone hopes that time will pass by. Something will be forgotten. Mm. Someone feels like in time you'll go easy on them, but I feel in time something will just be too late. As someone just put no effort into a situation because they were banking on the history of the connection. Mm. But I feel them putting in no effort has only made something inevitable. Something has become faded because someone was avoided, detached, toxic. The reason something is about to rain on their day is because someone failed to transform from their toxic ways. As I feel, this is someone who was all talk, hmm. fooling no one but themselves through time and toxic energy. Someone was inconsistent. I feel this is someone who needed validation and attention and they became cold, crossing the wires of a situation because someone was too bored. They were bored and they ignored this relationship. They ignored you and they didn't care about the consequences of it. They just relied on the history. Someone thought that they could m mislead you or be toxic in this connection, control you through emotion. But I feel someone was hot and cold or holding back because they were used to being selfish with you. As I said before, someone just got too comfortable. And because they got too comfortable, they thought they could cross the wires, make something of misunderstanding, and play the victim. I feel this is someone who is in the poor me energy. But I feel them sitting in this victim mode energy is causing them to stay elusive to change. But I feel what they refuse to change is about to change abruptly. There will be no validation. There will be no reward for someone who ignored you and held back. As all I see coming their way is consequence. Tough lessons. Tough lessons and justice. As someone is getting a taste of their own medicine when it comes to karmic debt. Because it's starting to close in on them. I feel someone's karma is starting to close in. There is really no where to go but take this journey alone. Because of all the pain, heartbreak, and loss they have caused, someone won't be able to come out of this easily. Even though someone is missing you in a big way, someone is going to have to go through it to finally, truly understand it. Because if this energy stays in the arrogant energy that they're in right now, something just might be final. 
But if you ask me, them not having access to you is just the least of their worries. As the karmic storm that is coming their way is about to teach them some lessons they'll never forget.